Welcome back everyone, Broadbent here. Today we're back in Shandard Deep on day 86 of our survival. Uh, so today we're going to be working on farming the shark. I want to get as many sharks as I can. Last episode, didn't have much luck at all. Uh, uh, the shark kept on like disappearing and all sorts, so we're going to do our absolute best today to, I guess, sort of fix that somehow. So I'm going to dive straight in and do a little bit of fishing. The supply is getting a little bit low of cod, so hopefully... Hopefully, uh, the shark decides to uh, to come for us while we're in here. So before it turns night, I'm going to quickly try uh, that hook idea. You know, I was talking about adding the hooks underwater uh, with the lights. I'm going to try that now. I'm going to add it... Um, I'm going to do it right on the middle foundation right here. There we are. Got a hook. Can I place that down here? Oh, I can. That's perfect. All right. So I'm going to place it right there and let's try and attach the can I reach a lantern yes there we are I was uh, kind of worried about that and let's attach that to it and hopefully hopefully that helps my visibility a little bit yeah I don't think that helps <laughs> I'm gonna pick that back up I just realized that I've not done a proper clay sweep of this island before at least I think I've done like bits and bobs, you know, like every few clay nodes that I found, I've gone for those. But I've never really like dedicated full 10 minutes to going around the island looking for clay. And I can tell because, wait, I think I've gone a little bit too far. There should be, where's the boat? Yeah, there's like a clay node right over here. Yeah, right here, look. <laughs> so, so what I'm going to do, I think, is go around the entire island and just take a look and see what I can find. Uh-oh, I didn't see that. The bush was covering it. Is that... Really? Two? Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, take a look at that. So there's a shadow here for uh, the, the lionfish, but as soon as I look at it, it, it starts to move again. They stop moving when you're not looking at them. So I don't really have enough inventory space, and hopefully this will help out a little bit. Eh, I'll be able to find it later on. <laughs> yes, there we go. Big man's in the house. That's what I've been after all this time. Oh my god! He's actually disappearing. Last episode, he was... Unless he spawned in. I, I, I am so confused. Come on then, I'll swim with you. Let's take you all the way over to the dock. I'm not letting you out of my sight once. Even if you bite me. <gasps> Which he isn't doing, surprisingly. Oh, come back here, you. Uh oh. He's gone. Oh, he's there. Oh my god. Where's he going? Is he going down to the deep sea? <laughs> he's legit just gone. He trying to lead me somewhere? Like, what? That's crazy. Well, alrighty then. This is going to be another annoying episode, isn't it? <laughs> he just vanished. Completely. But never mind, I got all this clay, which is kind of very important, so... I probably could have done the clay roof over there, but oh well. Alright, so I'm going to change things up a little bit here. Today's episode was supposed to be shark hunting. So we're going to head to another island here. So I'm going to top up the gyrocopter and we're going to head out. I think I've got pretty much everything that I need. So we're going to head, I believe, that way is the dead end of the map. So let's head south, I believe. So I think I've hit the eastern barrier, or the eastern like edge of the map. So we're going to turn, go past the uh, Megalodon mission, which apparently is at the corner of the map. Wow, that's surprising. And we're going to go straight south. Wait, is that an S? Oh, five. I didn't notice that last time. So I think I've been to this island before. Um, there's some clay around. I'm not sure if it's worth dropping off and taking a look. I don't see any trees, though. Oh, yeah, no, I've been here before. Yeah, take a look at that. So I think this is the eel mission, and I think I'm at the very corner of the world, which is interesting. I'm going to make a little pit stop here to refuel the gyrocopter. I've only got a quarter of a tank left. But let's just double check if this is that mission or not. Oh, 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 oh. Stop. I'll come back to that. <laughs> uh, I think it's through here. 
Yes, this is the eel. One eel trophy. There are rumors of a giant creature protecting the surrounding waters. Kill the creature to complete this objective. So let's do a quick little search, see if I've already been to this island. We should be able to tell due to the loot on... Yeah, it looks like I've been here. Wow. I've come really far in this world, haven't I? Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh dear. <laughs> quick! Ooh, I like this high mini before. Got crates right there. Awesome. So I guess the challenge is to survive, but also fill my inventory with crates. I kind of want to also start working on a second raft at some point. Let me get to some shelter really quick. I knew the crap straight away! So I'm going to get rid of the sunstroke, and then we can start to gather all the loot from this island. Oh, and right on cue, we've got a storm coming in. Well, I'm on the edge of the world, so hopefully it doesn't... Oh my god, come on. Hopefully it doesn't uh, get too loud here. It shouldn't do. So while the storm's here, I'm going to check out this wreck because I think it's protecting me from the sun a little bit here, which sounds bizarre, but I'm pretty sure it is. I can also use the storm, hopefully, to elevate myself up here. Okay, cool. Let's check out this first crate. Okay, I'll take that. That's nice. Another piece of tarp. Getting a lot of tarp on this island. A lot of tarp. So let's dive down underneath. I know I've got one. Oh my god, I need to stay away from you. That's for sure. I think I've got one up here. Um, I did see it. I did see it. Oh, it's on up here, isn't it? Come on, waves. You're not doing me any good right now. Get me up there. Okay, let's check out what we've got. <gasps> A lantern! Hell yeah. So let's check inside the cabin. I think the door's around this side. Whoa, this looks... <gasps> The snake's right there. That was so close. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Another piece of lashing, and that's it. Wow, that's disappointing. Whoa, look at all the sand. It's so wet, it just looks like one solid color. So I'm going to try to construct the water still straight away. I need to cut down. I need to make... I need stones. So let's make two small stone tools. Uh, I think I've got some lashing on me already. Yeah, I do. So I should be able to make an axe. Yes, there we are. So let's chop down a tree and make some of the basic things like a shelter and the water still. Coconut flask and that should be everything to make the water still. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to put this and yeah, we'll go up around about... Ooh, decisions, decisions. We're against this rock right here. That seems like a good idea. There we go, temporary shelter, and I'll pop that down right next to this here. Um, actually, no, I'm going to put that somewhere else. That's going to go... Yeah, why not? Let's put it there. So let's also set up a fire now. I've got to choose a good location for this. I'm actually going to go right next to uh, the water still. That seems like a good idea to me, so it's all in one spot. Then we can work on making the smoker. Definitely need the smoker. There we go. And let's face that the right way. Okay, so this morning I want to work on getting some food, at least, so let's get the, um, what do we call this thing now, the fishing spear up and running, perfect, so we are good to go with that. Um, I've got one PP if I do need it, or th one, sorry, one antidote, and that is uh, crucial in case I do get poisoned, I'm going to be going deep into the ocean to get the cod that I need. I'm not going to be messing around with any small fish, because honestly I don't see the point anymore. Oh, I've got a Wula Wula right here, I did not even notice that one. Hopefully I pronounced that right. <laughs> so before I head out, I'm going to do a quick sweep of the island, chopping down all of the uh, the small trees right here, getting the sticks and stuff that I might need. There we go. Decent pile of sticks already. Jeez, that's going to last a while too. All right, so let's chop these off and jump straight into the ocean. It should be around about time now. I'm just going to make sure that I can see enough too. I think over here I saw a wreck last night, so I think we're going to go in this direction and hopefully we will stumble across it. I think I see... Maybe the waves for it. Let's just go this way. Damn, the shore for this thing goes out so far. Okay, I see some waves just over here, or bubbles, I guess. Uh, that's what I'm going to go towards. I don't think that's where they were the first time. I think I saw some over there, but we're going to head towards the ones that I can see. Okay, yeah, I figured it would be a small one. Hopefully the crate's here. Yes, it is. Got some clay, too. 
I'm not really after clay anymore. That's something that's like taking a bit of a back seat lately. Oh, I think this is a big one. Okay, so I've got a crate already, and then I can loot out. I don't see any buoy balls or anything that I can use for buoyancy. I really want to start that raft. Oh, buoy balls! Perfect. Okay, got a fuel can. Uh, sorry, jerry can. Oh, some food. That's good. I, I keep doing that. I see some bubbles here. Okay, this is a... Oh, God. Great. Great. Hopefully, I can avoid him. Got some tires and buoy balls back there on the other raft. I think I can dive down here. <gasps> it's blocked off. And there's no crate on this floor, so, okay. I'm gonna get some air, and I'm gonna go for it. I really want those three crates that are in the bottom. So let's get a breather. Keep moving, gotta avoid that shark. Got, yep, fully good, okay. Oh god, I'm gonna squeeze through this. I'm so, di oh god, here we go. One, two. Is that it? Can I get my third? Is that back here? Okay, I've gotta get out. Oh! Okay, made it. Awesome. Okay, so here are the crates. First one, another gyrocopter vehicle part. Got an air tank that I can use to hunt the shark. Uh, got a torch, fishing spear. Get out of here, you. We don't want you. And the other one over here, got another lantern. A fuel uh, part, torch. Okay, okay, not bad at all. Just saying, if I was building a base here, this would be damn perfect. It would be a good start anyway, is what I'm saying. Uh, not a very good location for me. I've almost got every single part for an engine, too. I just need the block. Damn, that was good. Well, that was a successful fishing trip. <laughs> I didn't get anything. All right, this time, we're gonna get some food. Okay, got a little baby shark here. I don't know where the big guy's gone. Oh, there he is. Okay, good timing. Good timing. Okay, four fish. Four fish isn't bad. It's a decent start. Actually, instead of all this, I'm gonna head back to the base island. I'm just gonna leave this as is. In fact, I'm gonna bottle a few things up and start carrying them back. Okay, so I'm completely loaded up. We're gonna head back to the base island now. I'm pretty sure I know which way it is. Um. Um. Well, which way is that sea for? I don't see it. <laughs> well, I'm almost certain it's north. <laughs> so let's just go this way. Ooh, actually. There's a crate down here. Let's, uh, let's grab that one. Okay, so all the loot I got from that journey is over here, so let's take a quick look. It's really not that bad. It's all from one island too. I'm more impressed at the two lanterns, because that's like major right now. That's why I need to light this whole place up and make it feel alive. So I think I've come to the conclusion that I've got too many crates. Got all these, four there, six there, two here, three here, two there, and you know, another, I don't know, seven? <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> and then I've got all the ones in the uh, in the house. I'd say we've got up of 50 crates, which is mental. Okay, hey, you know what? I haven't killed one of these before. How many hits are you going to take? You're, you're not going to go in. No, stop. Okay. I thought you were going to... Whoa. I'm drowning. I didn't, wasn't even paying attention. Okay, hello, shark. Well, you're not going to get my stingray, that's for sure. I'll come back for you. <laughs> Why have I not killed one of these before? They're so goofy. So what I'm going to do is work on that elevator design that I mentioned maybe a couple of episodes ago. Something that I thought might work. So what I'm going to do is build a triangle foundation right here. Let's go quite low just so I can get on it. Um, like, oh, around about... Around about there. Okay, then we're going to build a doorway. Right here. Then let's place a door in, and that is going to be the thing that's going to trigger us up. Alright, so if I stand in here and close the door, boom, teleports me up to this level. Now, what I'm thinking, well, well does it work the other way, first of all? Let's try that. Okay, so it tries, it tries. Okay, so if I build another wall on the top here, I wonder if it'll snap me up two floors. Let's give that a quick go. Okay, I think that should be enough. There should be a bit of collision there, so let's give this a go. Fingers crossed. <gasps> it works! Oh my god! How do I get down? Let me try and... Okay, yeah, no, okay. Whew. Okay, so that's got to be taken into account. I don't know how to get down, but the elevator works. 
So I think now what I'm going to do is build a proper lookout. Now, because of where this is, I need to rebuild it in a location near some water. And I think right on top of this rock is a decent spot. I don't see why not. So let's get some planks. I'm going to vote right there. Then I can put a staircase in at some point as well here, so it shouldn't affect it too much. Now, I wonder if it'll work with the half walls, for example. I'm not sure. Well, there's only one way to find out. We're going to give it a go. Let's pop that down. Oh, actually, <gasps> no, I shouldn't have done that because I know you can't place them on top of the other one. I wonder if the windows are cheaper. Let's check it out. Okay, the windows only cost one. Okay, so let's do the windows. Wait, why can't I snap the window on there? I am so confused. I'm totally baffled as to why I can't build this on here. I think I actually have only one option, and that's to destroy it and build it again. Which is ridiculous, but I'm going to have to do it. Okay, let's try again. Doorway. Check. Door. Check. Functioning elevator. Check. Some planks left over. Check, I guess. Now let's try. Plank window. <gasps> okay, good. Good. Boom. All right, cool. Let me get up there and see... If I can place one down while I'm up here, I, oh, okay. I might have boo-booed a little bit here. Okay, so in order for me to keep on going up, I'm going to need the, where is it, splint, that's the one. Because I'm probably going to break a leg doing this, legit. So, let's get up there and finish off that top build, that top wall. Damn, that's so cool. I, I knew this would work. I had a good feeling about it. Okay, now in order to do the next one... I have to do something very tricky. Okay, did it. I think I broke something. Broken bones. I think I might be limping. Suddenly healthy again. <laughs> As you do. Okay, I've got another splint on the go here. Let's check out. Hopefully my health. My health seems alright. I'm falling from a higher distance. Hopefully I don't die. Legit could probably die from this. Um, I'm going to try and jump into the water, I guess. So let's get the hammer out. Now, because I've only got four planks left, I'm going to build one more wall, and then I'm going to build a triangle floor, and that should allow me to jump into the water with ease. Let's give this a go. Straight up, no problems at all. I'm going to try and jump that way into the water a little bit. Wait, could I... I could place that for a second there. Did you just... Delete it? No, it teleported me up. Oh, damn, that's so good. Look how high I am. I'm as high as that base over there. All right, let me get the floor. Like, right here. Can I not snap this on? Uh-oh. Well, that's an issue. <laughs> Hopefully, I can get down. Let's uh, let's try to get down, actually. Can I get a run, in, run and jump? Wait, am I... Oh, I can't sprint because I've got a splint on. <gasps> am I going to die from this? Okay, what's my health at? Okay, I think I should be good. Oh, God. I think I broke something again. Oh, my God. That was a serious jump. I think I need another splint, don't I? Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm not doing that again until my health's back up to full. That's bad. <laughs> All right. Well, unfortunately, guys, I've run out of time for today's video. Today was a bit of a mix-up. I wanted to do a little bit of exploring and, you know, adventuring a little bit and, you know, and I wanted to mess around with the elevator. I don't think I'm going to be doing too much with this just because of how fiddly it is. If I'm going to use it at all, I'm probably going to tear this all down and be building it over here. But then again, I don't need to. The ramp's all there. It's just a cool concept that I wanted to show off to you guys, and it does work. If you want to build some sort of sky base or anything like that, you could totally do this with this method. So let me know what you think to this in the comments below. Do you think I should make my own sky base or anything like that? Let me know below. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to press the like button. And if you're not already, subscribe to catch future videos just like this one. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.